For my project, I decided to do a train booking website for the fictional company ABC Rail. You can see their logo on the top here. So this is the homepage. You have the logo, the login, the search options, the search button, and the management login in the bottom. So let's say we come to their website and we want to look up trains from Kitchener to Toronto. So we enter in the information we want, including the date, go with December the 14th, and then we search for trains. So it gives us a few options. Uh, you have the cities and the departure and arrival times and dates. And let's say this is the one we want. So we enter the tickets we want and we hit book. Oh, well, you must be logged in. So let's go ahead and do that. Go to the login page, enter in the information, and hit login. So it brings us back to the home page, but the information is still here from the search. So we can just hit search again brings us back to the same page and we can enter in the number of tickets we want for the train, hit book, they're booked, awesome. So we can verify this by going to the profile page. So we have the different profile information which we can update and also payment information, uh, but we are going to go to view and cancel tickets. So we can see that there are the five tickets for the train that we just booked, great. Uh, but then there's also this other one here that we don't actually want anymore. So we can just go ahead and hit cancel and it'll cancel them. Uh, and we can go back to the ticket reservation list and see that they are in fact gone. So we know that they're not booked anymore for us. Um, and then go back to the profile and let's say we update our email. So we just update it and hit update profile. And then we can just return to the main menu by hitting the logo on the top.